All television and radio stations in the United States will now cease their regular programming. As you can see in Mark chapter 13 verse 8, instead of pestilences as we see in Matthew chapter 24 verse 7 as well as Luke 21 verse 11, it's troubles which is number 5016 in the Greek dictionary of the Strong's Concordance, which means a disturbance which is the same meaning as a pestilence metaphorically as you can see from number 3061 in the Greek, figuratively a pest in number 3061 is the Greek word translated as pestilence in Matthew 24 verse 7 as well as Luke 21 verse 11. A disturbance or a pestilence of the mind brought about through the hidden dynasty of education which lines up with the fourth seal, the first trumpet, and the first vial. 411 which means information but in this case it's misinformation. 1830 being when Joseph Henry's foundational research on the electromagnetic telegraph dates back to according to the Smithsonian Institutional Archive and the electromagnetic telegraph led to the telephone, then radio, television, and the internet. The technology now used to create the disturbances or pestilences of the mind whereby the Kenites are able to plant the seed of the mark of the beast in the foreheads of most Christians that will come to fruition at 666 when Satan appears as the Antichrist in Jerusalem, as Christ also warns us about in Matthew 24, Mark 13, and Luke 21. As you can see, in Matthew chapter 24, beginning with verse 1, And Jesus went out and departed from the temple, and his disciples came to him for to show him the buildings of the temple. And Jesus said unto them, See ye not all these things? Verily I say unto you, There shall not be left here one stone upon another that shall not be thrown down. And as he sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came to him privately, saying, Tell us, when shall these things be, and what shall be the sign of thy coming and of the end of the world. So what follows are the unprecedented events that are the seven seals and the first four seals correspond to the first four trumpets and vials in reverse order. But the spiritual death written of in the seals, trumpets, and vials won't happen until 666 when Satan appears as the Antichrist, which is when the seed of the mark of the beast comes to fruition in the foreheads of most Christians when all six trumpets of deception are sounding at the same time. So again, the first four Four seals are given in reverse order of the first four trumpets and vials and line up with the four hidden dynasties that began to be globalized in 1830. A literal pandemic is not an unprecedented event, so when Jesus says pestilences in Matthew 24 verse 7 as well as Luke chapter 21 verse 11 and troubles in the 8th verse of Mark 13, which means a disturbance as in a disturbance of water, which is symbolic of peoples, multitudes, nations, and tongues in the book of Revelation, he would have to mean something that's unprecedented as in the deception infecting the minds of most Christians via the four hidden dynasties thanks to the modern day technology that began to be developed in 1830, making it possible for the deception to be spread throughout the globe, which was unprecedented beforehand, because again, Joseph Henry's foundational research on the electromagnetic telegraph dates back to 1830, which led to the technology that not only allows the seed of the mark of the beast, to be planted in the foreheads of most Christians, but also the technology that makes it possible for the images of Satan and his angels to be transmitted onto all the smartphone, computer, and television screens at 666. When the spiritual death of most Christians occurs, when the seed of the mark of the beast comes to fruition in their foreheads, the mark of the beast being the deception that Satan is Jesus. As you can see in the fourth seal in Revelation chapter 6, hell followed with death, death Death being one of Satan's names, and hell is Hades in the Greek, and most of Satan's angels were cast into the deepest abyss of Hades, meaning Tartarus, as we know from 2 Peter chapter 2, verse 4. So then death and hell, meaning Satan and his angels, at 666, when their images get transmitted throughout the earth because of the technology that began to be developed in 1830, which is also when the rapture deception came into being, when the first trumpet began to sound, which is also when the first 
first vial was poured out, the first six plagues of Revelation 16 being the plagues of deception that will kill most Christians spiritually when Satan appears in Jerusalem as the Antichrist at 666, which is when those four angels get loose from the great river Euphrates, as you can see in Revelation chapter 9. So again, 411 lines up with the hidden dynasty of education and the pestilences and troubles, followed by 322 and famines, which lines up with 1913, which was the year of the Federal Reserve Act, lining up with the hidden dynasty of economics when the second trumpet began to sound, which is also when the second vial was poured out, and then 233 lines up with 1945 when the United Nations came into being, which is the great horn of the he-goat in Daniel chapter 8, verse 8, lining up with the hidden dynasty of politics, and the he-goat of Daniel chapter 8 is symbolic of the shadow government of the Kenites. And as you can see in Mark chapter 13, verse 7, and when you shall hear of wars and rumors of wars, be ye not troubled, for such things must needs be, but the end shall not be yet. The two world wars being what caused the United Nations to come into being, but the five-month-long hour of temptation won't begin until the one-world political system of Revelation 13 comes into being at the woe of the fifth trumpet. And then as you can see in Mark 13, verse 8, for nation shall rise against nation, meaning the Kenite nation rising up against itself through two warring factions and kingdom against kingdom, meaning the deadly wound to the one world political system of Revelation 13 that won't come into being until the woe of the fifth trumpet when Satan and his angels get cast to earth. And there shall be earthquakes in diverse places, meaning major geopolitical shifts, especially the shift from a one world political system to a one world religious system at 666, when Satan appears as the Antichrist in Jerusalem. 1948 is when Kenite occupied Israel came into being, lining up with the hidden dynasty of religion and the first seal when the fourth trumpet began to sound, which is also when the fourth vial was poured out, and as Christ says in Mark 13 verses 5 and 6, take heed lest any man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ, and shall deceive many, which is ultimately a warning to not be deceived by Satan when he appears as the false Christ, but it's also a warning to not be deceived by any man, including those who claim to be Christians and even those who are Christians, because again, most Christians will have the seed of the mark of the beast planted in their forehead through the four hidden dynasties, setting them up for the spiritual kill at 666. 1969 is when the fifth trumpet began to sound, but five is grace in biblical numerics, and it's during the grace period of the fifth trumpet that the seed of the seal of God gets planted in the foreheads of those who will be brought out of the deception during the sixth trumpet when the Holy Spirit speaks through those who get delivered up during that time. The five-month-long hour of temptation begins when the grace period of the fifth trumpet ends at the woe of the fifth trumpet after the great horn of the he-goat, meaning the United Nations, gets broken and the he-goat becomes the leopard of Daniel chapter 7, which is symbolic of the Kenites and their four hidden dynasties providing the infrastructure of the one world system that won't come into being until Satan and his angels get cast to earth at the beginning of the five month long hour of temptation and then two and a half months later after the deadly wound which again is what kingdom against kingdom means Satan will appear as the antichrist at the woe of the sixth trumpet and that's when the first six plagues of Revelation 16 kill most Christians spiritually because they're plagues of deception and again the mark of the beast is the deception that Satan is Jesus returned turn when his image as well as the images of his angels begin to be transmitted onto all the smartphone television and computer screens because of the technology that began to be developed in 1830 when the four hidden dynasties of education economics politics and religion began to be globalized but what the holy spirit will say through those who get delivered up during the sixth trumpet will be transmitted throughout the globe also causing many to repent being unable to take part in the first resurrection Resurrection when the true Christ returns at the seventh trumpet, the seventh vial, and immediately after the space of half an hour written of in the seventh seal.